What is up? Let's get to it. Let's gonna have let's have a, a snack number three. I think is where we're at. I hope you like my new background: a chair and some leaf decorations. We had a shindig this weekend. Had a little birthday party. Not for me. Orange laser and purple lasers. Also, there's a bunch of cards in here. We're gonna try to get through those. And I found this thing at the Target. Pokemon favorites in the palm of your hand. Ooh, doggy. Six plus. I don't know. Brody, you're probably not old enough for these. I don't know. We'll see. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. It's all right if you're not six yet. You can still look at these. Let's go with this first. Let's open it up. It's Sunday night. Fun weekend. Made a pizza stove. Oh, man. I might add a picture of my pizza stove at the end of this. And if you want to know how to make it, I can put more pictures into it. And uh, put it in the comments. Like, if you want to get some more deets, deets on the pizza stove, I'll add a picture to it in this video. So stay tuned for the pizza oven that I made. Made some good pizza out of it. Put some charcoal and some wood in it. It didn't blow up on me. I'm probably not going to, like, uh, advertise it because it's probably hazardous. I don't know. What? Pokemon Venusaur. And a, and a, oh, man. Ha! 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 Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Venus, I, I mean, Charizard coin. That is what's up. That's probably, that's probably worth the whole, everything right there. In here, oh, man, we got an Evolutions. XY, a Sun and Moon Crimson Invasion card. And this cool cat here, a Mew. And Psyduck. Man, that's what's up. My friends just texted me for Call of Duty. I'm going to tell them, hold on, I'm making a video. Let's open this thing up. And then after this, I have to go play Call of Duty with my friends. Friend? I don't know. Also, if you want to play Call of Duty with us, throw that in the comments. Say, give me your gamer tag and we'll figure out some Call of Duty time for... All right, let's turn it over. Oh, this is... Oh, man, this always means it's a hot pack. Sun and Moon Crimson Invasion. I don't even know. What, oh, I will, no. Oh, well. See what we get here. Oh, Counter Catcher. That seems cool. Sarav, it's Staravia. Seems cool. Grumpig, it's cool. Execute, that's what's up. Jigglypuff, that's what's up. Houndo, 60 horsepower. I just feel like if you were to put these two in a match, this Houndor is going to really do some damage to that Spoink. Kind of a, a wimpy. Whoa, and then you've got Mistrevious. Uh-oh, what's this? Look at this. Oh, look at that. Fighting memory. Oh, my good. I don't know. <laughs> kind of looks cool. What's that back there? Like a Lugia or something? I don't know. Maybe I'll have to look that up and see if it's worth anything. And, oh, I don't know. This looks just cool. Cartana GX. I'll have to save that thing. Both of these cards look really cool. All right. Those are done. What's in this Evolutions pack? Let's find out what's in this pack. I have to keep telling myself not to forget to show a picture at the end of my Pizza oven. One, two, three, four. And, oh. I don't think I did that right. Anyways, we'll figure it out. Because there's no energy card right here, which seems... I don't know. Radicate. Coughing. Trainer. And if you've noticed, I switched the orientation of my phone. The other way, it just wasn't working for me. Metapod. Oh! Pikachu! That's pretty cool. Ponyta. I just got a Ponyta uh, Funko Pop at the store. That's kind of cool, too. Put that aside. A Nidoran. That was always fun. A normal one on the blue. 
a Vulpix. Also used to get that on a Pokemon Blue. There's my energy card I was looking for. And, oh, that's a pretty serious Machamp. Okay, I'll take that. Those are some cool cards. Oh, there's my energy card. I really, these are from like playing Pokemon Blue when I was younger. Pikachu, I'm gonna hold on to that. Pikachu, 60 horsepower. In the house. Let's put these aside. Let's open up. Oh, this Don Russ. This Don Russ, I found this on the Target. Uh, I want to say I found things in Target. I really do, and it's really hard to find things in Target. I get pretty lucky. Let's open these. What do we got? Oh, empty box. People show me that all the time. Let's get to it. We got a few to get through. Pretty sure there's an autograph in here. I'm just going to call it early. If you want to know how I know, hit me up in my emails, and I'll tell you. But let's find out what we got. Jonathan Isaac, uh, upside down. Jordan Poole, another one upside down. I'm not a fan of this upside down. Jonas Valanciunas, come on, players. Upside down again. Damar Durazen, Tory Craig. Oh, Nikola Jokic. Franchise features. Sorry. Oh, and a little rookie card. Alexei Pukosovesky. Sorry, man. I don't know who you are. I think you're kind of good. I see people wanting your card sometimes. You just don't look like a baller. But <laughs> you can dunk all over me. Oh, Isaiah Stewart. I'll take a couple of them rookie cards. They look pretty sweet. Let's get to the next one. Next one is... Trash over there. Oh, I got to like that orange. Let's see who that orange is. Luke Kennard. RJ Barrett. Barrett. Joe Harris, Michael Porter, Jr., Dennis Skaharoder. If you know, if you watch my last video, you'll see I also don't know how to pronounce his name on that video. Uh, it was the NBA Top Shot video. Dorian Finney-Smith. I like this man. He's not going to be uh, a high dollar commodity yet, but maybe one day. I like that card. I'm going to put that aside. I have an autograph of him. Obi Toppin. Just said that's a cool name. Just a cool name. Oh, there it is. That Anthony Edwards. I picked up a top shot of him, too. A little normal top shot. I'm telling y'all, if y'all hadn't got on the NBA top shot yet, there should be some packs dropping this week. And it is what's up. Watch my last video if you want to find out a little bit more and, and how cool it is right now. Lori Markinen. Kawhi Leonard, Julius Arendale, Alex Caruso, Paul Georgi, Shy Gilgis Alexander, Orange. Pretty cool. Pretty cool little card. Kenyon Martin Jr., Elijah Hughes, rookie card, rookie card. Where are the rookie card? We want a signature. <laughs> People. Oh, what's this? Uh, probably Franchise Futures or something. Blue. Giannis Antetokounmpo. Mitt Kehel Robinson. Cam Reddish. Luka Doncic. Something. Pretty cool. Pretty cool little card. Marcus Smart. Is he from around here? SMU or something? I don't know. I say around here. I'm around the DFW area. Killian Hayes. I just got a really sweet limited edition NBA top shot of this man, too, going for around four bills. I got it out of the last pack I opened. I'm telling you, check the last video that I had posted. I like that card. I had to put that aside beside my top shot. Robert Woodard, Vernon Carey Jr. A couple of rooks there. I'm liking these rookies in here. The Donruss, I have some other NBA product that I'm going to open. I just haven't yet. Maybe some Prism. I would like to hold on to that Prism for a while. I think it'll be good. Karis Levert. Oh, no. Don't go up and down, up and down. Derek White. Yep, we're going up and down, up and down. Enos Cantor. Weirdest name. Like, what? Enos? I like it. 
OG, this one I like even better. OG Anunbu. Anunobi. Oh, yeah. Fred Van Bleep. League leaders. This is cool. Oscar Robinson, triple double for the entire season. And after that, we had a. Uh, who's that man that did it? Uh, Westbrook did it. I can't remember his first name right now. I'm blanking a lot as I get older. A Duke, hmm, Udoka, uh, mm hmm, a UA, we're going to call him UA. Denny Avdija, another pretty cool rookie man. We want to see some cool auto in here. A cool auto. Somebody good. Did y'all see that? Duncan Robinson. I heard him on the radio. It also sounds like he's got them donuts. DeAndre Hunter. I want them Dunkin' Donuts. Matthew Della Vadova. Oh, man. Back in the day, he was supposed to cover somebody. I don't remember. Eric Pascal. Aaron Gordon. Complete players. Kawhi Leonard. I was looking to see if there's anything on the back of that. It's just an insert. Might be good. I don't know the the rarity of the inserts in this yet. Oh, oh, and Grant Riller. You sure that shouldn't be an M and the Riller? Like Grant Rillum? Rillum? Miller. I think it's Miller. We're going to call him Grant Miller. Open it up. What's this one? What's in here? What's in here? When I open the worst packs, they have the best cards. That that pack got all ripped to shreds. It has the best cards in it. I think that's right. Bobby Portis, Tyler Hero, Heaven Hoarder, Siku. Are you kidding me? This is my auto, and I've never heard of this guy either. Come on, man. Darius Miles. Okay, though. Hey, it's an auto. I like my autos. Darius Miles. Signature series, set him aside. Franchise futures, Kyrie Irving. <laughs> he looks so old. Sup, Kyrie? Hit me in my DMs. CJ Alivi, what? Nico Mannion. I mean, these, I, I sure was hoping that that auto, so I, I'm torn whether I like the autos or the patches the most. Maybe the patches have the better players, but the autos are worth more, but you also get the worst autos. There's an orange one in here. What do we got? Jeff Green, Brian Forbes, Jalen Brown. Do I need you a little closer? Okay. Thanks for commenting and telling me that. Jamal Murray, John Collins. Okay. A little orange Vernon Carey Jr., uh, if he ever gets really good, I've got his orange card. But, man, what's going on with the corners of these and the Donruss? Uh, I mean, it looks fine. You can't tell as well. Whoa, a little dirty fingernail. Sorry about that. Sorry about that. Xavier Tillman. Desmond Bain. Desmond Bain, he's a good little rookie player, man. Coming up in the, if you look at ROI, NBA ROI. Voting uh, odds of ROI. Anyways, he's kind of up there at the top. And I'm looking at the odds of the Rookie of the Year for the NBA. All right, another orange. What do we got? Wesley Matthews. Oh, and up, down, up, down. Marquise Chris. Lebron James. What's up, Lebron? Lebron James. Blake, no don't Griffin. Ricky Rubio. Bojan Bogdanovic. Uh, I really just want to put him in the normal pile because pretty normal card. Emmanuel Quickly. He's also up there in the if you're looking at the voting or at the odds of Rookie of the Year for the NBA. Zeke Nanaji. Two left. Where he kind of got the card I was looking for. The Anthony Edwards rookie card, and I got an autograph. Again, if you want to know, let me know, and I'll tell you how I figured it out. Danilo Gillinari, Brooke Lopez. The only thing I don't know is Doug McDermott, who it's going to be. Terrence Ross. I have a Terrence Ross. Dunk. Chris Stapps, Porzingis. That's the first one I have of him. Oh, I like that. 
I like this a lot. Put this Trey Young up with my Luka Doncic. He was a player. He was a uh, Mavs player man for a minute well, until they did the Sadiq Bay. He's also a good rookie man. And ooh, Aaron Nesmith. Hey, Sadiq, I fell. I dropped your card, man. I hope it's all right. I'm going to leave these on the table because it's getting late. And man, am I sleepy. But I'm also not playing with my friends on the Call of Duty. Sorry, this is 15 minutes. This ain't much of a snack. Miles Turner, Mike Conley, Hassan Whiteside, Marvin Bagley the third, Doran Drogic, Great Expectations, Rookie Card, Devin Vassell. Am I getting these over a little bit? There we go. That Killian Hayes again. Man. Looking good. No, Patrick Williams. That concludes it, guys. Thanks for hanging out. We opened up and got a Pikachu out of everything. I want to post a picture of my uh, and of my pizza oven. My champ. Fighting memory. And a Cartana GX. It's a pretty sweet looking card. All right, y'all. Thank you so much for watching. This week coming up, probably some more Pokemon and definitely some more basketball. Thanks for hanging out. Like, subscribe, push the buttons, the bells, the whistles, get them all in there. And check out my pizza oven and like if you can comment if you like it. It made some killer pizza. I'm out. And right back to talk about this pizza oven. Check it out. It goes on fire. One of these things is probably going to explode. So be careful. I don't want to tell you to do this and then you get injured. So don't do this. I'm showing you mine. So it starts off with a base of construction bricks, cinder blocks, uh, 8 by 8 by 16. Make sure your ground's real flat. Start putting some blocks down. Um, as you're going, make sure that they're flat. You're going to want this to be a, a flat surface towards the end. I put four stacks of bricks up, four, so basically four stacks of four bricks, 16 bricks in total. Then we add some pavers, some 12 inch pavers. There's four of those and they kind of fit right on top. And then I start stacking these little paver bricks that I had in my backyard. I stack those up, I get four levels up and I add a 24 inch paver. That thing's no joke. Uh, you might want two people. Uh, I'm pretty strong. I can lift at least 60 pounds and I can pick this up and put it up there. So I got that added on, and then you want a little vent. So you got the bottom firebox, you want a little vent, so you kind of scoot that 24-inch paver a little bit towards the front. Make yourself a little, uh, I don't know, a little a little chimney there. This is actually going to go up into, that's funny, I made that, that last picture was a little, I had to redo it. So that chimney you actually want to come into uh, the firebox, or want that to come into the pizza oven. So this is where your pizza is going to sit. Your fire is going to be on bottom. You start making these pavers go up and you see there's a little shaft that goes from the back uh, up from the firebox through the back up into the pizza box. And then I covered it with a couple of 24 inch, uh, 12 inch pavers. You probably want to go the 24 inch here. I use some floor tile that's in my garage to, to span the, the space across the top. That's probably going to crumble one day. But I'm gonna tell you, put some fire in there, some charcoal for a couple of hours, let it get nice and hot, 800, 900 degrees, make you some pizza dough, throw it in there. It was a hit and I've got a air compressor for sale. So if you are interested in the air compressor, hit me up. I found this picture somewhere. I love it. I hope you love it. Thank you all for watching. Thank you for staying for a whole 19 minutes to see the best Easter egg ever.